just made the list of top 20,000 influencers under 20. Eee! Eee! Hey guys, want to know what I just did? I just looked up how to register to vote. <gasps> did I miss the voting for homecoming queen? No, to vote vote. In the election. We're 18 now, we can finally vote. Um, wasn't there an election two years ago? Oh yeah, that's the one that made Wyatt cry. I didn't even cry that much when my Albatross and Finch credit card got revoked. Their tank tops are so fat. Anyway. This is for the midterms in November. Oh, November's months away. Yeah, but you don't want to wait until the last minute to register. Wow, you're really nailing this adulting thing, Jen. I forgot to feed my cat for a month, and now he's... <laughs> <laughs> Have you seen what he's done today? Who? Trump! He's repealing the gun restrictions. Oh, how many days until the midterms? I have a counter on my phone. Okay, you are a huge nerd. And you need to chill. You're making me stress day up. Enough coffee already. Chew. What's <coughs> up, dudes? I need a squishy stat. You got it, dude. Oh, no. He's tweeted again. Now it's legal to shoot polar bears. Huh. I thought they'd at least protect the white bears. So we're all going to vote, right? Uh, count me out. What? You were with us at the March for Our Lives. You have to vote. Actually, no, I don't. Free country, remember? I'm protesting. Nikki, you're back. OMG, you look exactly the same. OMG, drop dead. Aw, I missed your bitchiness. <laughs> Sup, babe? Aren't you supposed to be at work? Nope, just got fired from the newsstand. Since when is eating a candy bar stealing? Uh, since always, Jonesy. Okay, wait. Nikki, are you seriously not voting? What's the point? Democracy is broken. No one even debates anymore. All they care about is taking the other party down. Ooh, cute hat, Jonesy. I'm trying to find one in millennial pink. Come on, Nikki. Look, even Jonesy's getting involved. Nice pussy hat. It's such a powerful statement. Statement schmatement. This hat's a chick magnet. <coughs> See? Um, I'm right here. Chill, babe. You're my girl. Just keeping my options open. Uh, that's it. We're done. You're breaking up with me? Yeah, that's what done means. So you're voting, right? Yep. I'm gonna make America great again. Oh, what's... He wearing? He promised to keep more money in the pocket of the working man. You're not a working man. But I will be, because he's creating jobs and putting America first. He's already reduced taxes. Yeah, for the top 1%. Dude, it's called Tinkle Down Economics. Look it up. Jonesy's making some good points. No, he's not. He solved Korea. East and West Korea are finally together again. North and South. Them too? See? He fixed all the Koreas. <sighs> okay, the rest of us really need to vote. Millennials are the largest group of voters now. We could swing an entire election. Voila, dude. Shoot, you know I don't use straws. It's bad for the environment. Oh, right. My bad. But... Every election, even the midterms, can help change the direction of the country. What's important to you? Rejoining the Paris Accord. Good. Finding sunglasses that don't make my head look so small. Not a real issue. Okay, my student dad is giving me nightmares. And by me, I mean daddy. Better. Jude. Um, guns are scary. Yes, they are. And now he's starting a trade war with Canada. I mean, who doesn't like Canada? Well, I have zero concerns. The guy's awesome, he owns 30 golf courses, has had three model wives, and tweets from a golden toilet. Jonesy, he's destroying the country. Blah, 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 hashtag fake news, hashtag bite me. Ugh. It's okay, Wyatt. Jonesy's entitled to his opinion. And the best way to express that opinion is to vote. But the election already happened. Don't we have to wait for 2020 now? No. This is the midterm election, and every election is super important. Explain it to me like I'm Jonesy. Okay. The party in power wants to pass laws, but they need them to be approved by the House and the Senate first. Oh, kind of like getting a manager to approve your store return. Yeah, okay. No. What were you all doing during Intro to Poli Sci? Updating my new blog? Probably napping. I took Poli Sci? Uh, uh, uh. Doesn't anyone understand why this is so important? I do. <clears throat> 
We live in a sweet country where every day when we wake up, we know we have inalienable rights. We have the right to life, puberty, and the pursuit of happiness. Getting to choose your government is a privilege that those old dad guys with the long beards fought for. And if they were here now and not dead, they'd all want us to be one big party instead of two parties fighting about whose party has the better music and munchies. Oh, I want us all to go to one big party. Uh, can I come? Um, no. So, voting's like giving our forefathers a great big hug and saying, you can chill. We got it from here. So, fellow young people of the earth, are you with me? Yes! What are you gonna do this January? November. This November. Vote, 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 vote! Okay, so many feels. I'm totally voting. Who should I vote for? No one should tell you who to vote for, Caitlin. I will, I'll tell you. Or I could see who Ariana Grande is voting for and just vote for them. We're just baby adults, little bugs on the windshield of the world. Who's gonna listen to us? Nikki, your vote counts as much as everyone else's. Attention, punks! You are all loitering on mall property. Oh my god, you're still alive? Uh, we aren't loitering, I'm a paying customer. And I work here, I think. You know what your problem is? You entitled millennial maggots don't know what it's like to be at war, to sleep in the ditches and crap in the woods with your bits hanging out for everyone to see. Agreed! In our day, these snowflakes wouldn't make it to halftime. But now they all get a participation trophy. If you don't vote, you're letting those two determine your future. Is that what you want? Harsh, dude. Let's do this. Where do I sign up? We're so woke. You doofuses know we can't vote in the U.S. election, right? We're Canadian. Oh, right. Wow, we really got caught up in that for a minute. Whew. So we're still boyfriend, girlfriend then? Eh, I'll give it some thought. Oh, come on. I'll give Caitlin the hat. Both of them. Jack Wagons, 